what's up guys welcome back to my channel as you can see by the title today i will be discussing balancing work and school and i know some of y'all are doing work and you guys are doing school as well just like me and i just want to give you some hope and maybe i'll share a few tips on how i manage work and school <laughs> service officer so my work starts at 8 and ends at 5 p.m. I currently started attending classes therefore I'm working and I'm going to school normally my bedtime would have been 9 no it has to move up to like 12 1 and so forth because I have to go to class and class starts 7 ends at 9 and you know your girl has to prepare and study and even doing assignments so when you're at work it's a different routine from when you're at school because when you're going to work first you wake up in the morning you go to the bathroom brush your teeth you take a shower put on your clothes eat your breakfast and so forth then you go to work now school school is something that you have to prepare for because you can go to class, especially in these times when Corona is around, we are facing a crisis and we have to go online and study and so forth. So the lectures are recorded and then you do the tutorial and so forth. And some of the times you don't get, you don't understand what is going on because there's no one in front of you. You cannot directly say, Miss, I don't understand me. But you have the option to do so. Most of us tend to be ashamed of asking questions in front of a bunch of group online because of criticism. So work can be exhausting, but having to balance work and school, that is stress. Having to wake up five in the morning Taking a bus, traveling a bus with water in your eyes and going to a place where you don't really want to be but you got to do it because you want to better yourself. Dealing with co-workers that are sometimes annoying and stressing. Dealing with customers, not to mention doing something you don't like. Who would want to experience that? Going to school is fine. But some of us go to work because we are we want to go to school. Because some of us didn't get the opportunity to go to college. So we graduate. Some of us didn't get the chance. So we have to be fending for ourselves and taking out loans. Working every day. Go after having to go to school in the nights and doing assignments that are so hard, having to do group work with others when you know that you can do it yourself or maybe you don't want, you don't feel, some of them, some persons in the group might disappear all of a sudden. You start the group work and then you see them don't come back to school and you're asking why they said they quit the course. I'm sure this is something that all of us face. Now, is work and school compatible? Hell no. However, they are both manageable. And if you, if you have good time management skills, you will understand this. So my advice to you all is that if you are in a position where you have to work and you have to go to school at the same time, then get enough rest, make a time management schedule, complete assignments as fast as possible so that no backlog and you won't stress over it. You can have five assignments, right? And you complete only one. You have four more assignments. You go to work every day, Sometimes you even forget to go to class. Sometimes you sign into class late 
and the teacher already reached half of the lesson and he said, I want to go on. But as, I, as I'm saying, get enough rest, do your assignments on time. If there's any questions that you need clarity on, you ask your lecturer. You make sure that you understand every curriculum, everything that they're teaching, because we are not going to school for a waste. We're not going to waste money. We won't. Anyways, let me tell you how I, me, how I balance work and school. So as I said before, I wake up early, I go to work and school. No, I make sure that I watch the pre-recorded lectures um, before I start classes because each day, each day we have a class, there's a lecture. So I watch them like an hour before and then I sign into class five minutes before class. And I make sure I ask questions if I'm not understanding. After class, I, I don't go to bed sudden because I make sure I bed before class. After class, I would read over what I've learned and try to understand if, if I don't understand I continue to study that area until I get it in my thick skull and I make sure I eat in the mornings because guys some of the times you're working so till I'm a hard worker sometimes you work and you feel so stressed out and you not even forget for you don't even remember to eat that is me I carry a cup of tea the other day to work and it's lunch time I see the cup I saw the cup on the, on the counter and I'm like I was so pissed because I've been working so hard that I forgot to feed myself just good time management skills will help us all okay so thank you all for watching my video I hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on that post notification bell. Give me a shout out, Instagram me, tell me some ideas. I'm gonna add, I'm gonna do a video of answering assumptions about me, so you guys can go ahead over there and message me. Thank you, bye.